Lynn Brown to show you about the Butterfly Barrel. It's a barrel racing saddle. It's quite short. It's quite light. It uh, drops in around 20 pounds, 22 pounds. It's built like a miniature reining saddle. This is a tree. This is an OD4 horn. What you see on here is the OD5. The OD5 has a little longer spoon shape. It tilts forward just a touch more, but it's a little thicker through here. It has a pistol grip. I have more barrel racers that like this one than the OD4. So the tree itself has pretty generous relief cut in the swells. So you can get forward, your thighs right in there. You have a narrow enough waist in the seat. You have the good twist in the bar that keeps you from pinching in the front. You have an eight inch gullet right here. So close contact, narrow waist to the seat, very secure and a nice groove and a relief cut on the thigh for the swell. The finished saddle is like this. There's a few differences that I put in this saddle like the cowboy dressage. Under here, I have what's called a bareback cut. If you can see this, first you have, if I can hold it in place, first you have the skirting leather, and it has a cut. Right there is soft. It's the same leather as in the seat with sheepskin underneath. Because of the strip strap loops, I can do this. There's no strap running over the bar of your tree to create a strip strap bump like there is in other saddles. That bump, once the skirt breaks in on a regular saddle, where the bar comes under the tree, it puts a set of knuckles into the skirts after those skirts break in with enough riding and sweat. So every time your horse tries to reach with the hindquarters and bring his back up, his back hits that set of knuckles, he stops reaching. He stops stretching. He's a pain in the gait getting ready to go into the arena. This is what we eliminate with strip strap loops, along with very free swing. What you have in a skirt is two slots, one in a normal position, the second one if you need to run your girth up into the front to hold the saddle back for some reason on a downhill young horse, for instance, you can do it. The second layer of skirting goes across the first layer right here. It's there. It goes up and over the tree bar in the rear and in the front. It has rawhide in between to make this long lasting, but everything is flexible. Everything is closer to riding bareback than anything you have been on. Free movement because of the strip strap loops is much freer than what you find in any of the Martha Josie, quote, free swinging straps. They're not free swinging. They're running up over the bar of the tree, sandwiched in between the skirt and a tree bar to later give you a nice strip strap bump. So this is Butterfly Barrel. And uh, people that have ridden it love it. They're ordering their second one. I have a lady that's making payments on one right now. That's her second saddle because she doesn't want to ride her other horses without it at a meet. I hope you like it. Thank you very much. Lynn Brown.